Welcome to a short video summary of the Arcam AVR750 AV receiver. You can read the full review by clicking on the link in the description below. The AVR750 is Arcam's flagship receiver and retails for around £3,700. The emphasis is very much on sound quality, so the AVR750 has a stripped down front panel with only the basic controls and essential connections included. At the centre is a large and informative display and beneath the display you'll find a series of buttons that control the AVR750. These include input selection, menu selection and mode selection, as well as the volume and mute controls. The only connections on the front are a 3.5mm input jack that doubles as the connector for the setup microphone, as well as a 3.5mm headphone socket. The only other features on the front are a power button and an air vent, so there's none of the large input dials and volume controls found on most AV receivers. With its clean lines and minimalist design, the AVR750 is a very attractive AV receiver and the build quality is excellent. The Arcam is a 7-channel AV receiver and it uses Class G amplification. This is explained in more detail in the written review, but essentially is a hybrid design that delivers Class A performance at greater efficiency. The provided remote control is slim, lightweight and comfortable to use and includes all the buttons you'll need to effectively control the AVR750 and perhaps most importantly it also includes a backlight. Although for those that would rather use their iPads there's also a useful app. Arcam also include a setup microphone for use with the automated room equalization software. Arcam's simplified approach extends to the rear panel where the emphasis is very much on the connections you'll actually need. So you get seven HDMI inputs and two HDMI outputs you also get optical and coaxial digital inputs, analog inputs, speaker binding posts, and 7.1 channel preouts. In addition, you get a LAN port for a wired connection, a USB port, and a connector for an FM DAB aerial. There are also composite and component video inputs, as well as an RS-232 connector for serial control and 12 volt triggers. This stripped down approach is continued in the menu system, which is functional rather than attractive. Everything you need to set up the AVR750 is included, but it isn't as flexible as some of the competition, although there is a basic automated room equalization function. The features are limited, but there is the option to stream content from your home network using a wired connection, as well as built-in FM and DAB tuners, along with internet radio. Although the Arcam AVR750 isn't cheap, it does deliver a fantastic audio performance with both movie soundtracks and two-channel music and as such we're happy to award an AV Forums recommended badge. You can read the actual review at avforums.com forward slash reviews. You can also see more videos at avforums.com forward slash videos. And why not follow us on Twitter? And like us on Facebook. Thanks for watching.